All right, it is finally time to unleash my army of 100 or more dogs. So I decided to breed over 100 dogs and why did I do it? Who knows? Well, I've already gotten over 100 bees in this series as well as over 100 villagers. So for some reason, this only seemed right. If you guys go on to enjoy today's video, make sure to subscribe because I've got heaps of other dumb things planned for this series. And also we are quickly approaching 400,000 subscribers, hopefully by the end of April. And this video shout out is coming from Twitter. Thank you to this person. You're an absolute legend. Well, I'm glad that's done. That's our dirty work for this episode. Another 200 melons added to the farm. You guys know the drill. Every episode, we're adding 200 more until this becomes massive. For the start of this episode, I just want to formally say I have been doing a bit of building around here. As you can see, I've done this bridge, done some staircases, some paths, just livening the place up a bit. It, it feels a lot cooler around here, especially with these two giant farms just towering over. And also, if you look at our levels right now, you can see I have a lot of them, and that's because I've been working working on a huge project that you guys probably won't get to know about it for a while but just know I'm working on something big but it's good that we do have these levels because it does mean uh, we can finally go ahead and finish off our enchantments maybe all right so we still need to put our boots together and our helmet with respiration so the boots are gonna cost 31 levels the helmet is gonna cost 37 since the helmet's more expensive I think I'm gonna go with that so we're gonna add respiration 3 to our helmet cool all right well that's all the housekeeping let's get on to today's video all right so I was thinking it's been a while since I've done just some sort of stupid mission in Minecraft so as you saw by the title today we're going to get 100 dogs but before we can do that we're obviously gonna need to do some construction Oh snap, we are two sticky pistons short. There we go. All right, so I've made a slight extension to, uh, to Dogsy's home. Just slight, you know, nothing too suspicious, I wouldn't say. It makes perfect sense that the inside is still the exact same size. Would you look at that? We now have a secret underground lair with a completely obvious lever. Bruh. So now our next job is to actually extend and build out this underground lair down here. So we have room for 100 dogs. So I'm gonna go get some more materials and I'll be back. <coughs> All right, so I've just gone to the nether and I've got a bunch of supplies, quartz, crimson stems, nether bricks. And funnily enough, we actually managed to find another wi wither skeleton skull just randomly while we're in there. So that's good to have. But anyway, that's not the job at hand. We now have the task of building a secret lair for Dogsy's army. I guess I don't want it to be too ginormous, but also I don't want it to be too small either. So now that's the room all planned out. It's about the size it's gonna be. Now we just need to uh, design it, do some interior design. So here's the plan I have in mind. The walls are gonna be crimson wood and nether, nether brick. On the floor, we're going to have dark oak wood and red carpet. The ceiling is going to be a combination of dark oak logs and stone bricks. And it's all going to be lit up with redstone lamps. I now present to you Dogsy's hidden basement. Ta-da! It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life! It's kind of it's kind of fresh down here. Um, all that's left for us to do now, though, is to get some dogs down here because we need to get breeding if we want a hundred dogs. First things first, let's grab some bones. Let's go head out into the wild and let's try and find some dogs. All right, here we are in the wild. We've found ourselves a wild dog. I love you. Oh wait, what? Huh? This is very confusing. Long story short, I thought this was a dog I had somehow tamed in the past, but then lost, but it wasn't. I just didn't have my particles on. So let's just go back to capturing my slave dogs. 
I meant dogs. Is that a dog? It's a chicken. You are not a dog. This is big brain time. Get him, new dog. Get him. This new dog suck. Get him, you dog. Get him, boy. You can say this area is still ridiculously laggy, but... Oh my god! Oh jeez, oh my god! I think I've spotted another dog. Dude, my luck is incredible. Well, that's two. We're up to two dogs. Let's make that three and four. I see so many dogs now. Dog is a madman. We've got six dogs. Hello, dog. You'll make a fine addition to my team. That's seven dogs now. You know what? Get them, dogs. Get him. Get the chicken. Go. Oh, I reckon we've got enough dogs for now. I'm going to walk all these guys home. Hopefully they all survive. Yeah, th this makes perfect sense. This may be the fun bit. Don't know if this is gonna work, but I hope they all just follow me. Actually, this is working quite well. I've got three in here though. What and this, this one is perfectly fine. Oh. Come on, dogs. What are we doing? How many is that? We've got six down here. Oh, seven. Can I use a lead on you? I can. And just like that, we have made a very successful start to our dog army. All that's left now is to breed them. <laughs> oh, look at that. Breed. Breed, you dogs, breed. And now we have puppies. That's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. So from that, we now should have 12 oh. dogs roaming around. Fun bit about this is going to be keeping them all in one spot. All right, so a lot of you guys, well, I saw a few comments actually saying I should try and retame Jeff with... Oh, okay, yeah. No, you were absolutely right. I did not think that would work. Yeah, I'd, all I had to do was retame Jeff with bones. Wow, you guys are so smart. Why did I even get Dogsy if I have Jeff? Why are we still here? It's disgusting. What is that? What am I looking at? All right, Jeff, you can have magenta. And Dogsy, you can have light blue. Nice. And then we'll make sure to keep all of our other 100 dogs with red collars, just so we don't get confused. We know which dogs are which. A few inches later. All right, it's feeding time. The worst bit is going to be making them have, have to sit down every time after I breed them, because otherwise they'll start running around with me. I think now we have probably about 16 dogs, I think. This is a mess. Okay, I think that's it. All right, bred more dogs now. We're maybe up to 20 something dogs. Six and a half hours later. All right, I've got another dog update for you all. It's no secret you come in here and all you hear is just dogs barking. <laughs> oh, this is so funny to me. Look how many stupid dogs there are down here. I think I did a count earlier. We have about 53-ish, 54 maybe. Oh, I'm gonna regret this. All right. Everyone stand up. Oh no. It's so impossible to manage. Getting all these dogs to sit down again after making them all stand up. The worst thing. The absolute worst thing. Breed. Well, there you go. This is ridiculous. Oh no. Oh no. I forgot. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. We can fix this. I have an emergency plan for when this ha- Oh my- No. Alright, here's the plan I had for if this ever happened. We just run through here fast enough. I think- I think that worked really well, actually. Two thousand years later. I think it's finally time to do the last bit of breeding with my dog army. This is already a ridiculous number of dogs and it's only going to get worse. Oh, there really needs to be like a way to just make all dogs sit in an area and all dogs stand out. This is painful. All right, I've put everything I need to into this army of dogs. We now have well over 100 dogs in here. I'm just gonna wait for all the babies to grow up and then our army is ready. As you've already seen, I've put a lot of time and effort into raising this large army of canines. And what was it all for? Well, if I'm gonna create an army, I may as well take it out to battle. This is about to be fun. Why? Why have I done this? Oh no, oh no. Now, we some of these dogs may not make it out from this battle. We may get a few casualties, but... Some of you may die, but it's a sacrifice I am willing to make. Alright, now let's cause some chaos. 
Oh, I hit a dog. Oh, I'm hitting all the dogs. Look at them go. Killing machines. Look at them all. Get it. Get that sheep. Go, go. Let's try this one. Let's try this one. Oh, they're just too... They're too quick. Okay, well, sheep are a bit too easy of a target though, aren't they? Like, sure, it's easy enough for 100 dogs to kill a couple of sheep, but what would happen if we had 100 dogs and we went hunting for some mobs? Alright, the sun is starting to go down. I'm curious, will dogs fight an enderman for me? Oh, they absolutely will. Oh my god, look at them go! Get him! Oh, that is so good. That is so good. Another enderman. Get him, boys. I love this so much. Oh, it's all been worth it. Now this is the real test. Oh, I don't even need to attack this one. They just go straight for it. Get them. Get them, boys. What about the zombies? I, there's a zombie around here somewhere. Yes, get the zombie. There's so much going on. We're starting to get some enemies now. Okay, the creepers I'm scared of. I'm not trying to fight some creepers right now. They will definitely ruin the party. Oh no! I killed a dog. No! Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Get him! Get him! Get him! Oh, they've split. They've split. Oh, creeper. Oh, no, 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 no. Really do not like that creeper. Go, dogs, go. Fight for me. Swarm him. Swarm him. This is absolute chaos. So, yeah, it's been confirmed. 100 dogs in hardcore Minecraft is totally OP. Oh, and it's also been confirmed that the biggest threat to my own dog's lives is myself. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Get a good final look at my army of dogs. This is probably the last time you'll see them. It was a ton of fun breeding and fighting with all these guys. I just don't know what I'm going to do with them now. All right, and the final thing for this episode, as you can see, we've got our levels that we needed to finally finish our enchantments for our boots. Combining these two for 31 levels means we now add depth strider to our boots and we have the perfect enchantments, in my opinion. I'm still curious, should I add thorns to my armor? I'm not sure, actually. I'm really not sure. Um, but let's try out Depth Strider 3. Let's see wh what it does for us. So previously, this is the speed in which we were swimming. In fact, is it? Even this seems fast. Okay, well, I'm expecting Depth Strider 3 to be super fast then. Oh, yeah, that's speedy. That's speedy for sure. That is some good Depth Striding. All right, anyway, so now with the addition of uh, Aqua or... Aqua. I don't know how to say it. I hate that I can't. Okay, so now with the addition of Aqua Affinity and Respiration 3 on our helmet, as well as Depth Strider 3 on our boots, it means we're pretty well equipped to maybe go do an ocean monument in the next episode. So if you want to see that, let me know in the comments below, because I'm thinking it's about time we did another boss or whatever you would call that. And of course, if you made it this far, make sure to subscribe because it would help me out a ton and I'd really appreciate it. And I'll catch you all in the next episode. Cheers. What was that? You've just finished watching the video and you don't know what to watch anymore. Well, why not head over to my second channel, Wadtui, where I post wacky vlogs and stuff and awesome videos. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just self-promoting, that's all. Hope you enjoyed the video.